What are we doing to find and attract and, and retain good people? The purpose of our company is to drive positive change in people's lives. So we're doing a lot of things to take care of our employees. I've got over 25 second generation people in our company. So we find ways to make sure that their personal lives are improved through programs and education and training. Uh, we try to uh, promote within and we try to bring people into our culture um, from other people that are already working within our organization. They're our best mouthpiece for uh, developing and finding good talent and we rely on them to help bring in good people to work within our organization. Well, first and foremost, you've got to have a good culture. And culture isn't created overnight. It's something that's from within. It's something that defines what values to have, like integrity, respect. Those things matter a lot to a lot of employees. And so I think the best way to attract employees is with your own current employee base. If your employees like to work here, they're going to find other employees to want to work with you. And so you obviously need to have a good brand, good awareness, uh, be part of the market, uh, and then you know, have a good culture so they can find your own employees. Trying to attract good people, what we've been doing and found the most successful is referrals by our own um, employees. If we can um, reward them and reward the new employee exactly with, you know, many things um, that's been what has been helping us to succeed in this uh, labor shortage doing to find good people is we are building content and becoming the brand name of our industry so what we're doing is trying to create a brand that is exciting a brand that is moving and a brand that people want to be a part of so when we talk marketing everyone talks about clients if you go to K&D and sit in a marketing meeting, all you're gonna hear is employees, candidates, prospects. We're going after team members more than clients because good team members will get you those referrals and bring you those clients. We focus on our internal culture, creating a just enjoyable place to work for our employees so that they can tell their friends and then they can bring uh, solid, uh, talented individuals into our organization. The way we're attracting good people, first of all, we've really, we're looking at ourselves to be the best leaders we can be, to, to find people that want to grow. They want to be, they want to be inspired to do great things as they want to reach their own full potential. Secondly is uh, having an amazing culture, which there's a spectrum in there and we'll get into that soon. But third, Obviously, you got to be out there, right? So uh, what I found for recruiting to be very effective is you actually need to know, make sure everybody knows your brand, right? So a lot of us, we, we know we're big. The industry doesn't. And it's funny when you go look at other people, hey, have you heard of our company? You know, go ask 10 people. And depending on who says yes, that's the market share you have. You've got to increase that with, with recruitment. So the more people actually know your name, the, um, there's ups and downs, right? The, there's economy goes up and down. Good people are unfortunately let go. Good people leave their bad leadership bosses. So you could actually be the person they come to. So obviously, indeed, zip recruiters, right? But we also know the kind of resumes we get, it's all over the place. I mean, we've had resumes for janitors that want to <laughs> you know, become salespeople. It doesn't work, um, but in general, you have to be out there, you have to be looking, and you better know how to interview.